everything heavy when we step up. You can't hang with a gang, you a fellow. Yeah, everything check, come Stella. Wagwan beautiful people, I am Chef B. If you're new to this channel, welcome Wagwan. Make sure you are subscribed down below. In today's video, we'll be styling a wig from Beauty Forever on AliExpress. And the unit that we'll be trying today is a headband wig. So I'm going to show you guys what the wig looks like straight out of the package, what I got in my package, and all that good stuff. So I got about three headbands that you could also get from the same company. And I'm going to show you guys what the wig looks like straight out of the packaging so we're gonna do a shed test we're gonna look at the texture of the hair and all of that so the texture looks really silky it's a Brazilian water wave and I got mine in 26 inches so I'm just gonna run my fingers through the hair and show you guys how the ends are looking so the ends looks really nice however I did get a few shedding with this hair so if you want to co-wash the hair before you actually wear it so you could get all the loose hair out of it that would be great so we did experience a little bit of shedding so what i'm going to do now obviously to prep for the headband wig i'm going to slick back my edges you know do that suit doop you know what i'm saying do a little bit of edge situation you don't got to do nothing extra um i like to do a little bit of extra sometimes depending on my mood so that is what i'm going to be doing so the edge control that i use is she bomb she's bomb is it she bomb or she bomb she bomb collection edge control so i'm just gonna put it in the link if i did not say that correctly so anyways we're doing the swoop doo -doo doop action and then um we're going to put on the wig so get your edge brush whatever edge control you want to use it's all up to you Now I'm just gonna readjust my wig cap. And let me just say, with headband wigs, you don't necessarily have to wear a wig cap. And I strongly encourage you not to wear a wig cap and use the combs that actually come in the wig for extra security. Because this wig wasn't as tight as I needed it to be to feel that security. So I'm just gonna show you guys what I use to um, secure the wig on my head, just so it feels a little bit more tight and a little bit more secure but if you got a pea head like mine um, you're gonna need to tighten that band as much as you can so i'm using a little bit of um, light hair oil um, this is just like a sleek and shine you don't have to do this because the hair is already silky but i do this with all my wigs just because sometimes out of the package it might look one way then when you wear it outside especially in the winter it might look a little bit dry so i always use my um sleek shine oils on my wigs just to make sure that when i wear it outside it doesn't get too dried out and then looks hella trashy so i do that and this is how the hair is looking so i'm gonna style this hair a bit because you know we don't want to wear it plain and boring you know what i'm saying so we're about to get dressed and once i'm dressed um we're gonna do like two little pieces in the front and then we're gonna do a ponytail so i'm just gonna show you guys how i'm gonna prep the hair to do this to get those two little thingies in the front if you follow me on instagram you probably saw me post this like in a tiktok type um reel on my instagram and on tiktok so i'm gonna take my louis vuitton um silk scarf and then i'm gonna tie it at the base so once i do that you what i would also encourage guys because it still felt slipper because i am indeed wearing a wig cap and i didn't actually use the combs in the wig which you should use you can use a other headband before you apply the headband that's going to show to add that extra security so if you want to double up on headbands do that you know what i'm saying if you got a small head and then i'm just going to like flip the hair over to create the ponytail and while i'm doing this the hair started to slip a bit so um i'm just going to show you guys how i readjusted the wig and then added some um extra security and tightness to the wig So 
So once I get my ponytail, um, you guys see my wig cap. So I'm going to pull the wig back down. And what I'm going to do is to add the extra security. I'm going to add bobby pins all over the back and onto the side. So I'm sticking it um, like attaching the wig to my cornrow so that it stays on. So I would encourage you guys not to wear a wig cap. Use the combs in the wig and then add bobby pins and an extra headband on top of the headband that you're going to be wearing and that is the look now to keep my ponytail like a little bit more high i'm gonna put some bobby pins behind the ponytail just to like fluff it up a bit just to get it like you know i don't even know how to describe that look but y'all see what's going on you know what i'm saying so yeah this is the look and i'm feeling it it's so carefree this is how the back is looking it's undetectable so you won't be seeing any wig cap nothing like that in the back it looking real secured in the back you know make sure you double up on them bobby pins like i told y'all and this is the final look don't forget to follow me on instagram snapchat and twitter at damn that's chef um all the details that you'll need to know for this unit will be in the description box down below if you haven't subscribed to the channel as yet go on ahead and sub subscribe down below and i'll see you guys in my next video go on big up on yourself bye guys everything heavy when we step up you can't hang with a gang you a fellow yeah, everything check, come Stella. Let me 